in this video we are going to get ready with our main menu container component and we will use this you know this uh, card from bootstrap 4 uh, so that we can uh, reuse it um, across multiple components because you know, this is the replacement of panels in bootstrap 4 so yeah i would uh, want uh, to be easily reuse this thing so let's look at how we can do that okay we uh, we have a modules folder where, where we will you know go about adding all the you know, different kinds of modules and their components but there is a components folder which comes by default and what i typically do is um add all the reusable components here okay so let's create a new uh, view file which is card.view okay and if i go to my home blade i'll say this is the markup for the card right from here till here so i'll copy that let's you know uh, stub the basic view file and add this c format document right so yeah i think um mm -hmm. i don't need the alert I will remove this entire part. This is my body. Okay. And yeah. So this is the component. Basically, I have a template with the you know card wrapper. And what we will be using in this is something in view called slots. Okay. Slots are like um you know areas where we can put our own markup which will be displayed in another component so what we are trying to do is make this card a component where we can put anything in the header section and in the body section but not as data but as actual markup okay because i don't know what theming will come here i i want to make it generic Today I may have an image. To, tomorrow I may have a table. I can have anything inside this, you know, uh, card body container. So that's where slots come into picture, right? So um, the slots will have names so that we can um, uh, reference them later. So I'll have my first slot, and I will name it as title. Okay, and this will be empty, and the next one will be body okay so this particular component has two slots which means i can add um, any kind of markup in these two places whatever i put in there will actually become the markup in here so this will get replaced with what i sent okay um, now obviously i typically would want my components to be globally available okay um so i think i can use this because anything which is okay no let, let it be i'll have card component which is going to come from the card dot view file okay and i don't need the example component i will say these are the global components okay and these are based on the module so i have a card component and which will mean i will get rid of this entire thing okay this row and in here why don't we directly go to the container okay so um, I'll have a row and then I'll have column MD8 and one four okay so basically I'm dividing it into two columns this particular page and then what I can do is I'll call the card component in here 
and I'll have template with name as title I think that's what it will be my menu items okay and I'll have content will come here this is my body and similarly I'll copy this paste in this second column and I'll say add menu item form will come here and then in here menu container will be added items is json encode what home controller menus dollar menus let's refresh and nothing is happening oops what happened so i there's some error mm -hmm. error compiling the template is it because not in quotes yeah okay so i think i have the data in place and um now the two components are coming but the titles and other things are not coming so let's quickly see um this is correct template i have card with slot name title and the slot name body which is fine so then where is the problem template i think it's not name but rather slot yeah slot i always make a mistake i get confused so i think now it should come yeah so yeah this is what i primarily wanted you know you to understand that we can use certain components um inside our view application so you know i th this particular you know application has nothing in it you know if you if you see uh, there's no script written to it it's just a placeholder you know um, template uh, which you know provides some markup and uh, what i'm doing is i'm calling the main con main menu container and that menu container is using the component twice and you know, saying what component what content comes in here and if you see basically i had the card body and the slot is being replaced with what i am passing in the template as slot name right so yeah i think um, you know vue.js uh, slots are very powerful they are very easy to use and uh, it helps us uh, create reusable components which we can use across our application so yeah stay tuned while we then figure out how to display the menu items and create a form which will add the menu items as well thanks for watching guys if you like the video and like the series do click on the thumbs up icon and don't forget to subscribe to my channel